Aloha everyone and welcome to Hawaii. I'm currently on Big Island and today we're going to be celebrating 180 subscribers. Um, I usually do this thing on my main channel where I have seasons where I do two months of traveling and I take a couple weeks off. Um, this is probably my last time doing that. I'm going to be doing two weeks on, one week off from now on for traveling and stuff. There's a place over here I'm going to go check out um, and get some food. It's kind of weird being back in an uh, English speaking place because I forgot people can understand me. I'm used to being somewhere else where they don't speak English and if I mess up, they don't stare at me, but I just messed up a little bit ago in front of people and I forgot everyone can understand me. Um, but we're gonna go to this place right here, get some lunch. Hopefully they have mimosas. I'm starving and I'm thirsty. So let's go do it. This is a beautiful looking pina colada. Wow. Well, cheers. Thank you guys for all the support. like a wedding venue place kind of gives me a little cult vibes just a little bit but yeah I'm kind of disappointed I wanted a bigger beach and this is really the only beach that's close to me but we can still go over here I think this is like a wedding thing where people can get married here and stuff there's another beach that's a mile away that's supposed to be like down that way it shows it has sand I don't know how big it is, but we're gonna try it. I'm also sweating. I have my pants on. Like I said earlier, I used to do this thing where I would do two months of traveling and then I would take a couple weeks off. But while I take those couple weeks off, I would go somewhere by myself, relaxing. I've been to San Diego, San Francisco, and now I'm in Hawaii. And just to kind of reflect on my past travels, to give gratitude and just you know focus on um, what I'm doing and stuff like that so I always just come somewhere with the beach or somewhere relaxing and kind of meditate reflect read journal whatever it is um, just to kind of focus more on the present moment and stuff oh I almost just slipped but look how beautiful this is I'm really tempted just to change into my swim trunks like behind this bush or something I don't know I don't know if you guys can see, but I do have 188 subscribers right now on the second channel, which I'm super grateful for. So thank you to every single person that's, you know, supported my videos, subscribed, whoa. Sorry, subscribe, like my videos, just showed support in any way. I'm truly grateful for it. I'm so grateful and I'm so thankful for it. So thank you guys so much for all the support. Kind of just started the second channel to have fun and to travel and to give like tours of cities, food, culture, interact with as many people as possible and stuff. So. Uh, thank you guys for all the support. I truly love what I do and I'm super grateful for this opportunity to travel the world and interact with people and uh, I'm grateful I can just, you know, bring a camera and video it and try to show other people different parts of the world. I think that's a really cool concept. So like I said, thank you guys so much for all the support. I truly do appreciate it. I'm su super grateful for it. And I really need to go find a beach right now because I'm sweating. I have pants on and it's very humid here. So we're going to continue our walk. It's about half a mile. Hopefully there's sand. On the pictures it shows the sand. So we're gonna go there and uh, we'll lay down at the beach over there. And then the elevator is here. You go this direction and you hit it at 45 nights. 45 nights. Thank you so much. Appreciate it. Perfect. I still don't own a pair of sandals yet, so I'm rocking my dirty Air Force Ones with my swimsuit. The one thing I've been doing YouTube pretty much full time now for a year on my main channel at least and I can officially say I'm getting good at vlogging in public and not caring um, about people watching and stuff which is a huge thing I feel like for a youtuber to get over looking stupid in public in front of people okay this is awkward though I don't know how to sit down in this like you can't really swim it's up to my knees it does feel really good though, it's refreshing. 
Look at this view. This is the side of Hawaii they don't show you. <laughs> Let's see if this Hawaiian crab is friendly. Honestly, it gives me spider vibes. It's like weird, it moves weird. I don't like it. Yeah, we're not trying to cause any beef with these Hawaiian crabs. So it was fun while it lasted Kids Pool, but I don't really want to uh, risk getting a crab up the butt. So we're not, ouch, we're not gonna do that. But this place is really cool. But like I said, I have so much ADD going on right now, I'm sorry. Look at this. It's speaking of ADD. Look at the size of that crab, that's disgusting. I'm going to put the camera away for a little bit. I'm going to meditate. I'm going to lay down and relax. I brought a book, maybe I'll read the book, we'll see. Um, this is kind of why I wanted to go to Hawaii though, because usually when I travel, I'm always filming, I'm always on the go, and like a lot of people assume I just go on vacation all the time, but technically it's work because, you know, I'm non-stop filming and stuff. That was much needed, very relaxing. I'm gonna go rinse off in the crab infested kid pool over there. And then I'm very thirsty, so I think we're gonna go get another beer, a pina colada or something like that, um, drink some water, relax. There's a restaurant right over there, right on the ocean that I wanna go and check out. And then after that, we're gonna go check out those other like local shops and stuff. There was like a strip of local stores and stuff. We're gonna walk around there. And uh, I think that's gonna conclude the video. I'm just trying to relax today and do nothing too crazy and just enjoy my time in Hawaii. That's what it's all about uh, for this video. So let's go over and check out this crab infested little kid's pool. Just to be nice, I'm gonna give you guys a quick little uh, POV of the Hawaii water, so I'm gonna go under and it's really cold, so I don't wanna do this, but the things I do, you know? Okay. <sighs> oh my gosh. Only a foot deep, so this is kind of super awkward to go under, but here we go. Mm -hmm. Salty. Very salty. <coughs> well, there's your POV of Hawaiian ocean. If you guys want to find the exact same spot I was in this little pool right here, find the restaurant Papa Kona in Kaolui Kona, uh, Big Island, and then literally you'll see a beach right here, and uh, you guys can come over here. It's actually really cool. There wasn't a lot of people. It's pretty private. The only thing that's gross or that words me out is there's a lot of crabs. But other than that, this is a really cool spot. It's pretty private, uh, so I definitely recommend checking it out. I thought it was really cool. We found this place that's right across the street from the ocean. There's a cool place up top. It's a beautiful looking beauty plata. Love. Cheers, second channel. Alright, I didn't realize how bloated pina coladas make me, but wow. I've had two and my stomach is like full and I feel like dog poop. So no more pina coladas for me. I don't want to keep complaining about those pina coladas, but I am down bad right now. They're sitting in my stomach. I don't know if it's the rum or what it is, but it's just, it's sitting in my stomach. I'm so full. <sighs> but beautiful view. We're sitting up here on this cliff. And you just, you can't beat the Hawaiian vibe, that's for sure. I'm not gonna film any more videos while I'm in Hawaii. Uh, I'm gonna try to step away from the camera and just kind of enjoy a trip without uh, feeling obligated to film and stuff. Like I said, I'm always on the go, I'm always filming. So it's nice to kind of step away from that every once in a while and just enjoy a trip um, without having to feel like I have to film, go out and do stuff. And it just takes a lot of energy, especially show social battery. I'm slowly recovering from that. Oh my gosh, look how pretty this fish is. I have the worst ADD in this video. <laughs> There's a blue and green fish. I don't know where it went. It was really, really pretty though. It was like a light lime green and a light blue. 
is beautiful. Look at all the crabs coming down. Why are there so many? There's a big one over there too. Oh my gosh. This video is 80% about crabs. You know you're in Hawaii when there's three roosters just casually crossing the street. We're also in the middle of nowhere. I have no idea where I am. All right, you guys, thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. This was just something different. I usually travel to a different country and interact with people and like the culture and stuff. But I'm on kind of a little vacation right now just to enjoy, um, you know, the past trips I was on and then kind of plan the next couple trips and stuff. So I'm going to be in Hawaii just kind of relaxing and enjoying my time here. But thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Thank you so much for 180. I think we're at 190 uh, subscribers now.